You know, I get I'm supposed to use a condom every time, but that's so not my reality. Sometimes I'm kicking it and it feels so good and I just want to go with the moment. Sometimes the guy is just so hot. Yeah. And sometimes I just feel alone or I want to connect and finally get real with somebody. It might not make sense, but I really do want to protect myself. It's just that the next day, all I can think about is HIV. I hate that, you know? I want to live my life, but for real, I do not want to get HIV. And that's why when I learned about PrEP, I was like, there's something besides a condom I can use to prevent getting HIV? I was all telling my doctor, I want that. She said PrEP stands for pre-exposure prophylaxis. It's like, you know those pills people take when they travel to another country so they don't get malaria? It works so long as you take it, but it stops working when you don't. My doctor says nothing can protect you perfectly, but taking PrEP can reduce your risk. And here's the serious part. If you take it and try to use condoms and get tested and be smart about using all your prevention strategies. So I wanted to try it. She said taking PrEP is a big decision because it means you have to see your doctor every few months. I was like, I can work with that. She gave me a lot of information. She told me about how it works and about the side effects that some people may have and steps I can take to make sure that PrEP protects me as much as possible. I know PrEP is not a magic pill that just makes HIV go away, but it's one more thing that I can do to improve my chances of never getting HIV. I can just relax and live my life. For more information about taking PrEP, talk to your doctor or go to this website.